over the past week we had a uh, fishing tournament. It's concluding and we're going to have the awards event and uh, some information boots. 20 grams. We actually got a better turnout than we expected. We had a total of 129 participants that entered the tournament. So, and it, uh, a wide variety of, you know, uh, people, you know, a lot of kids, families, and uh, some avid fishermen that entered the tournament. So what we're going to do then is we'll get these other fish weighed. The primary goal of this uh, this event was actually outreach and to to really highlight the importance of you know our estuary habitats as uh, um, habitat for sport fish and also to promote you know and promote and support the local recreational fishery and also to spread awareness of um, invasive fishes that inhabit these these areas and the potential impacts that they can ha they can have so a lot of these invasive fishes you know have uh, traits that that make them that give them a competitive advantage over native species and they compete with the native fish for for food and habitat and uh, we've also had some fishermen uh, re report to us that they've been actually catching more invasive fishes, like tilapia, for instance, uh, while they're targeting, you know, these native mullets. So it's it's uh, been reported to us, and uh, they suggested that you know maybe we need to do something because the fishing has been changing. So you know we want to do something and address that problem. Four fifty three, three seventy seven, and as far as actually completely removing them that's you know that's unlikely uh, but we can at least do the best we can to mitigate the, the impacts and you know reduce the population as much as we can to to give the native species a, a fighting chance 1725 